the 13-disc Elvira Movie Macabre Coffin Collection that was released on the 23rd by Entertainment One. They sent it over for a review. I figured I would just do the most awkward thing possible and review it on camera. As you can see, it's a pretty sturdy tin. Kind of reminds you of the uh, old Anchor Bay tins. It's got an embossed uh, cover, as you can tell. Really, really shiny. Of course, it's got Elvira on the cover of it. On the back, we got all the information. 13 disc, 25 hours. Or, excuse me, it's actually 38 hours of uh, movies. But 26 horrific movies, nonetheless. And, of course, it's got a lot of public domain titles that she hosts. Night of the Living Dead, I Eat Your Skin, uh, Werewolf of Washington, Bucket of Blood. Pretty much your usual suspects there, but of course they're all hosted by Elvira. And the set, which you can't tell, because it ain't picking up on the camera, is in full screen. But I guess that's probably expected from this series. The uh, actual tin is a lot more manageable than the other coffin I have, which is of course the Blue Underground one. You know, excuse me, I'm not left-handed. I mean, pop this thing open. As you can see when you get into it, got some pretty good, if you can hear that, pretty good material there inside the lid of the coffin. We've got this, which folds out to show you what all was on each disc. And of course right here, very sturdy, we have uh, all the discs which, if you want, you can use this method and it goes all the way down. So it's, it's kind of like a uh, a beefed up Mill Creek package in some ways. Um, I would say uh, maybe it was cost efficient, although the set I believe on Amazon is still I think 80 something dollars right now, but nonetheless they're snug in there. You don't have to worry about them falling out, but I don't know. Of course, we've kind of got past the days where you get a case for every disc, so what can you do? But nonetheless, each disc, as you can see, has two movies on it. The first one has, of course, Not a Limb Dead and I Eat Your Skin. And uh, I'm not quite sure if the disc contains any extras or not, because I haven't got to pop them in the DVD player yet. But, uh, it might do it. But if not, you still have at least the movies and, of course, Elvira. But, like I said, it's, it's a, not a bad set for anybody who is a big fan. If I can get that to go back in there. Anybody who is a big fan of uh, Elvira will probably certainly want it. And, uh, just for comparison... I realize this isn't the only other coffin set that was made, but it is the only other one that I have. And you can see the, of course, big difference in comparison between this coffin and the old blue underground blind dead one. But, not bad. It's very easy to either sit on the shelf with your other movies, or, and it stands up pretty good. Although it won't hear because this is a camera. There it goes. Um, stands up on the shelf if you'd rather display it that way. Again, not a bad collection at all. And uh, if you are into the lovely uh, Elvira and what she does, then go ahead and click the link down there below and go get you a, uh, a copy of it.